Hey up, viewers and vioresses, and welcome back to So You're Being Hunted, with me, Felt Marshal Rot, and me, General Red Strategist. That's a terrible joke that I just made, I'm still using that weird persona. But welcome back, everybody, to uh, So You're Being Hunted, to uh, episode 173, and the next instalment of the Deutsch Challenge. So, remember the rules of this challenge, it's basically a kind of let's play, except it's sort of like the Crazy Vegan one. Uh, except the twist, obviously, with this one is where we, you know, we have to pretend to be German. And we have to use this this ridiculous German accent, yeah? And uh, every sort of five minutes or so, we have to go up to the robots and tell them that we're a Berliner in German. Ich bin ein Berliner. You know, which actually means I'm a pastry or something in German. Since a Berliner is technically, you know, the name of a type of pastry in Germany. But yes, uh, we've already cleared out a few uh, device pieces on this island. Which leaves us one more in the centre, yeah? And then we have to go to the next islands to get the device pieces. We must go and blitzkrieg the shit out of them. The scheisse out of these islands. Now I saw a wisp over in this direction. He's over there. We must follow him and see where he goes. Because he will obviously lead us to a device piece. And I must say right now, this is by far one of the most ridiculous uh, challenges I've done. But I'm enjoying it. It's uh, just, you know, old-fashioned silly comedy. I uh, hear those robots there. Heard you before I saw you. And the Bloody Wisp is actually going in their sort of general direction. Which is not ideal, really, is it? Oh, shit, there's a landowner over there. Now, hang on, there's another Wisp over here. If we dart between them... Oh, fuck you! Why are there so many pheasants in that one field? What a joke. Jesus, why are they everywhere? That's not good. That's is not nicht gut, everybody. I need to find uh, some robots, obviously, to do my first Ich bin ein Berliner of this episode, that is. Now, if I can find where the device piece is, that'll be ideal, because, you know, I could just do it to the robots. Ah, there it is. It's over there. Speak it, devil. Are there robots near it? Yes, there are. We can do the whole Ich bin ein Berliner thing with them. That'll be the first one. Down. Down and in for the count. Okay. Uh, how are we going to do this? I should probably eat some food first. There we go. Take my vitality back up to 80. We'll eat this jar of jam as well. We do have one empty bottle. We have a couple of alarm clocks set to slot two. Uh, we'll put them, I do think, maybe behind these rocks here. Spooky music inbound. Spooky music is being deployed. There we are. Okay, set to 40 seconds. That's good. Alright, slowly does it. Keep rounding them in this sort of direction. Give a wide arc, like so. Oh shit. You didn't see a thing, buddy. I'm stuck on a big rock. I'm stuck on this big rock here. Yeah. Let us position ourselves behind this device piece. So that so the Venzi. So that Venzi. Alarm clock goes off. It's hard to maintain this accent. <laughs> oh god. Alright, you two. Should be moving off at some point. Enabling us to get there we go, right. Off they go. Awesome. You two just home in on that sound, please. Keep up. That's it. What was that? Got it. Awesome. Hello. You've seen me, haven't you? Yes. Ich bin ein Berliner. There we go. That's the uh, parameter of the challenge met first time. Well, for in the first five minutes at least. You guys uh, could probably do with the leave. <laughs> I'm sorry, I cannot talk. Ich bin unable to speak. See, I've been having this um, in this little recording session of mine. Done a couple of episodes for Rayman and, you know, had the same problem in those. Couldn't really talk at all. It really wasn't good. But there you go. Okay. Let's check out uh, some of these buildings in this village. In this village, yeah. There's this little English village. And I shall raid it. Um, we, uh, we do only have one set of bandages, so we could probably do with a second set. Just to be on the safe side. There we go. Two is always usually a magic number. There's, uh, nothing in there. No sign of any squires. Nothing like that. Take those pickle legs. My character can also eat those if need be. Oh god, that's a bit laggy, looking in that direction then. Right, I should uh, go off and actually deposit this piece of the device at his standing stones, and then we can move on to a second island. Island Zwei. 
But if we can move on from Island Ein to Island Zwei and to pick up the device pieces there, yeah. Just after we have been back to these standing stones, we have cleared this island faster than the German Blitzkrieg. No, 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 no. Uh, no. No Second World War jokes, please. I keep saying that and then I keep making them. I'm very sorry, Germans. I'm very sorry, Deutsch people. Truly, I am from the bottom of my heart. Please don't comment in the uh, comment section saying that I'm not being very sincere. <laughs> oh dear. Oh god. Alright, let's put this here. There we go. That's good. Center Island cleared, yeah. Now, I did see... Well, I did see a uh, emblem. Or not an emblem, a symbol for a jetty off in that direction where I came, but... Obviously, let's just bugger off in this direction. And see what's over here. Oh man. God. I feel very full. I had a very big lunch. Flipping remnants of a barbecue calzone from a local takeaway. I went off to uh, visit Phil up in his hometown. He went out and got a takeaway from this little uh, pizza and kebab place. Good God. Had this big, large barbecue calzone. It was about friggin'. What was it? About 12 inches or something? Good God, it was huge. Flippin' didn't eat all of it, obviously. Had some for bloody breakfast this morning. Still had loads of it left over. And tried to eat up the remainder at lunch, but good God. It's left me feeling stuffed. I feel like I might have to do some exercise just to, you know, try and burn off some of the million calories that I've no doubt taken in from that. Oh dear. The barbecue appears... Uh, not pizza. The barbecue calzone sounds fine, General. But it is no match for bratwurst, yeah. Whatever you say, Fell Marshal. Whatever you say. Okay. You know, this is probably the first Surya uh, being hunt well, this one and the last one, probably the first Surya being, so being hunted episodes, where I can actually say that I've had a conversation with myself. <laughs> you know, with this Fell Marshal rock character I just seem to have made up. Whatever the hell am I doing? Okay, right. There's a jetty over in this direction that's shown up. Let's go and have a look at this one. This will either be the south or the east one. I'm guessing probably the east one. I hear you in that village. You freaking robot gits. The robot schwein hunts. There it is. There's the jetty we seek. As these are the jetties you seek, yeah? Right, so I'm, yeah, definitely thinking this has got to be the East Island, this one. I can't quite remember what biomes I set these to, or whether I set them to custom or anything. I think I set them to custom, but I'm not sure. It's been a few days since I recorded that. Well, I say a few, it's probably been like a week or so, or maybe a week or two, I don't know, since I recorded that first episode of the Deutsch Challenge. Yeah, yeah, I know that. Oh no, this is the North one, okay. I was completely out. My sense of direction wasn't working very well there. You are disoriented, ya, yeah, General. You need to get your orientations back together. Just as soon as this island loads in. Okay. God, it was also a pretty salty calzone, if I may say so. I still feel pretty bloody frickin' thirsty after it. It was just laden with chicken and donna meat and barbecue sauce. And probably a shit ton of salt. Probably, you know your weekly recommended intake of salt in one bloody pizza. Right there. That's usually the deal with these flipping takeaways. It tastes delicious, but it's probably utterly unhealthy in the extreme. Is that up there? Well, it's just a tuft of grass. I was wondering what that was. I thought it was a dog or something looking out proudly from behind that rock over the landscape. Yes. That could be a good little... Uh, Seen for a thumbnail there, that could. Hang on, if I just centre that tower there, and get that. Awesome. Okay, uh, should be paying attention to where that wisp is going. Oh god, it's a bit hilly here. I need to jump in order to get up it. <laughs> jump, General, yeah. Keep going. That's it. Oh god, where did the wisp go? Where did the wisp go? Hello. Hello. Guten Tag. Where are you? Where did you go? Isn't really. Oh, hello. See you too. Oh God, it's a big kind of ravine there. Oh jeez. Um, wonder if it's possible to lure them into the ravine. That would actually be kind of interesting, 
Okay, let me just drink one of those. So I've got two bottles. There's to sort three, like so. Um, is this possible? Can I actually get them to go down into the ravine? It would be interesting if you could actually do that. Oh, God. Jesus, it's a big freaking canyon. Isn't it? Bloody hell. Let's do it. Let's chuck it down, like so. Did they actually hear it? Can they get to it? Oh, my God, they might actually... Oh, no. No, they can't. Okay, that's going to be a problematic one to approach. Because obviously on one side it's just inaccessible terrain that they're not going to be able to go to. So we're going to have to plan out the approach to it fairly carefully. Okay. Oh, careful now. God, yeah, this is definitely custom terrain generation. Just trying to remember. See, look, there's a wall down there right inside that friggin' ravine and there's stuff down there. Statues and things. Don't mind me, I'm just fiddling with my mouse. Something came off it. One of the little pads on the underside. Oh dear, look at that. Such a terrible generation, yeah. Is this what the English countryside is like in real life? Yes, Phil Marshall, it probably is. Probably is that messed up. Okay. Just keep heading over in this direction. The device piece should be over this little ridge. So if I crouch... And, oh god, careful. Get over there. There we are. Spluttering like an old man. Okay. Throw a bottle over there, please. But yes, you go... Oh no, what are you doing? What are you doing, you bugger? You're going off... Oh god. This is risky. They're not going where I want them to go. Um, yeah, hang on. Let's put my stones into slot 5. We'll throw them as well. Have it. Okay, I don't think they can get up there, so maybe I should direct them down rather than up. Right. They did not freaking hear that, did they? No. Take that. Oh, come on, really? Just the one of you? Or is he stuck there? Number two. Oh, fuck me. What are they doing? I think the terrain generation's got a bit weird. They're not able to get where they uh, to where they need to go, which is not ideal, is it? I might just have to charge in and get it. Well, that won't be a problem. I mean, I could just do my HP9 Berliner thing, couldn't I? Mm, it's risky, because they're probably going to end up shooting the crap out of me as I get in there. Yeah, I think that guy's stuck, because the steepness of the terrain and all that, I think is undoing him a bit. Fuck it. Let's go for it. Wow, they actually didn't see me. Ishmi 9 Berliner! And you somehow missed me from that range. <laughs> see ya. Shus. You bastards. You schwein hunts. You scheisser gits. There we are. Excellent moving, General. They didn't know what hit them. For them, the game is over. Right, so we keep moving back off in this direction, like so. Whoa, careful. We'll go and save at the jetty. Okay, so that's one of those locations where being gung-ho actually kind of paid off. That's not normally how it works in the friggin' real game. <laughs> what, do, what do I mean, the real game? This is the real game, what am I talking about? It's not how it works normally in the game, that's what I'm trying to say. God, this hillside is very steep. It's amazing my character can run on it. At such an angle... God, that, bal that bloody calzone really was salty. I'm so bloody thirsty. I need to go and get a glass of water. I've already had one. But good God. It's ridiculous. <laughs> okay, right. Let me just save here. I'm just going to jump cut the footage because I seriously need to go and get myself a glass of water. So I'll see you in a second, everybody. Okay. Glass of Vasa acquired ya. There we are. So I've got my glass of water. Just sate, you know, sate my thirst a bit, if that's the right word. Quench my thirst. That's a better word, actually. Oh, man. Damn, so much salt on that bar barbecue calzone. I've just been going on about it all this episode. Whew, dear. That's a bit high-pitched as well, that was. I didn't just make that noise. There we go, so we got one device piece, two more on this island. Zwei more di device pieces on this island, yeah. Okay, let's have a look at... Oh, God. See, every time I gulp down water and then I start doing commentary like this, 
I immediately start feeling like I'm getting gas coming back up my throat, bubbles, you know. It's a bit ridiculous. And I end up, uh, you know, gulping on air, hesitating, pausing, things like that. It is not very professional, the yeah. are. But what can you do? You just have to stomach it. Let's go and check out this village. I'm wondering um, what sort of biome I base this on. It's got castle bits, it's very hilly, it's got rural kind of villages. Oh, I hear you moving around, robots. Ah, another bottle, we'll take that. Let's put that there, that device piece. Do I have a torch? I do. Slot four, there we go. Should watch out, it's making me very visible. Ah, get that Stilton, there we are. The Stilton is very tasty, ah. It's wunderbar. Um, I'm just wondering, actually. Yeah, I'll take some pliers, because poachers are going to be spawning at some point in this uh, challenge. So I'll just keep them on me in case I ever end up uh, wandering into a trap. Right. Turn that off for a moment. There we go. Where is that balloon going? It's going off in that direction. A sip of water. Hmm. There we are. Good. Goody gumdrops. Let me just flash those freaking robots over there. Look at them. Ah, <laughs> oh, they can't see it. That reminds me of a very, very fucking cringy joke I made once in Sir You're Being Hunted. It was quite a few episodes back. I made that same joke with a squire, but I said it in this really cringy expression. Please don't ask what episode number it was. A, because I can't remember, and B, because I don't want to remind... Now, because, you know, now that I'm saying it, I don't know why I'm reminding people of it. Because it was such a cringy thing to say. It also reminds me of another cringy joke I made in Surrey once in another episode. I think it was when the industrial biome had come out, or not long after it had come out or something. You get those, you know, giant slag piles. Yeah, I was making a joke about the word slag, and good God, I was reviewing that, and Jesus. Oh, why did I make such terrible jokes? I'm ashamed of myself. Eat my chocolate biscuits, stuff them down my gob. There we are. Alright, I wonder if we could take another piece of the device here. Um, now, oh god, there's a robot coming in from the left there. What's he up to? Hmm. Is he on his own, or does he actually have companions with him? Does he have friends? Yeah. Nine? Yeah, nine, nine. Hmm. Well, there's a dumpster right here. Just realised, didn't even see it. It was kind of blending into the environment. It's got another bottle in it. Oh shit! Someone saw me. Ich bin ein Berliner. You can't kill me. I am visiting German. Yeah, German tourist, not spy. Okay, fortunately the terrain makes it quite easy to lose them because it's so hilly and they can't path up certain slopes, whereas I can with this little jumping parkour trick. What are they up to? Oh, nope. You did not see a thing, you bastard. Right, I've got two bottles. Probably try using these. Okay, oh god. Seeing the gas problem again. Oh dear. Chuck one. Have it. Oh god, that's attracting robots from the other direction. Have that other one, please. Cost about three of them. It's on the bloody path and all. That's no good. Go, drink some more stout. I need it. Well, I, I don't need it. I need the bottle. <laughs> Get over there, you bastards. Should probably drink the other one. Nope. In case I need that as well. I know it's a bit of a waste, but what can you do, eh? Right, keep moving. Slowly but surely. Oh god, they're moving back. Oh shit, he's in me. Shit. Okay. Benign Berliner! I'm off towards your friend over here in the balloon. That's totally not a bad idea. Why am I looking in there? Being shot at? Proceeds to look in telephone box. General Red Logic, right there. What are you doing, General? Why waste time with these silly little post, uh, post telephone boxes? When you're being pursued by robots with shotguns, yeah? Yes, good point, Feld Marshal. I'll just uh, bugger off back to the jetty and save the game again. As I do. As you know what I'm like. To use a very peri I mean, it's a politically, politically incorrect term. I'm a spastic saver. In well, in some games, in others I'm not, but you know. Is that tower just generated floating a little bit? Yeah, it has. Well, that, you know, that's what happens with the custom terrain generator. 
know, what can you do? Uh, after I've had this glass of water, I think I'll make myself a proper cup of tea. It'll be good. It'll be very, very good. Uh, where is the jetty? It's, um... Here. There it is. Just couldn't see it because of the lip of the land. Or the shape of the land, rather. Okay. I think I'll drop down here onto this jetty. Save again. I think I'll wrap this episode up. Oh, there we go. Excellent. Save progress. Awesome. So there we go, everybody. I think I'll wrap up there. That was episode 173 of So You're Being Hunted with me, General Red Strategist, Unter mir, Feldmarschall Rotia. So, this is a bit more of the Deutsch challenge. We've done well so far. We've got another couple of pieces of the device with which to be uh, working with. We'll obviously get one more on this island, and then we'll be able to move on to another island. We're doing fairly well so far in the Deutsch Challenge. If you're not doing so uh, already, you can follow me on my Facebook and Twitter pages. Links in the video description, as usual. It's a good way to stay up to date with my uh, uploads if you don't have a YouTube account, and therefore don't have uh, subscription notifications, or don't receive them, rather, as of when I upload... Uh, not upload, publish my content. But in the meantime, this is General Red signing off before I start garbling all my words up, as I'm pretty much doing, and hoping you all join me for episode 174, where we'll keep going with the Deutsch Challenge. That balloon beam is just slowly filtering in there from the left. <laughs> it's a bit ominous and scary. <laughs> Jesus. But yes, thank you everybody, and in the meantime, this is General Red signing off. Goodbye. Oh, got him. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Get off the edge. Oh, no, no, go. Get out of here, get out of here, get out, 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 What's that monstrosity finished off? Get over there. See ya. Oh shit, no, 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 no. Oh, fuck. I did not mean to do that. Oh, please don't tell me I have to kill it again now. Shit. God, stop, stop it, stop it. Stop it, stop it. Yeah. Oh, Lord. No, 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 no. Holy crap. This area is horrible. Oh, oh my God, I'm being shot to fucking pieces. Ah. Oh my, what the fuck? Holy shit. Holy fucking shit. Whoa, Jesus Christ. Holy shit. Fucking hell. Bloody hell, that did like a million damage. This better not be a- Whoa! Shit! No, oh my fucking god. How many, what?